If you look back for the past 20 years, there's been an enormous amount of innovation in RFIC and RF technology, be it cellular communications or Wi-Fi or RFID, and we don't even think about those technologies being there. That's been greatly enabled by advances in RFICs. This is a great example of what people talk about as we common innovation, a combination of electromagnetic design, circuit design, and process technology development to enable RFICs to deliver the levels of performance that we take for granted today. Many of these technologies were about making it more efficient use of the spectrum. We've taken that to almost as far as it's going to go. If you look at where the market is going in the future, it's all about these multi-antenna technologies. If you look specifically to the RF and microwave industry, we have a strong capability across the signal chain. We have a core competency in digital signal processing, data conversion, RF and microwave. It allows us the possibility to solve much more complex system level solutions and bring higher levels of integration and performance to this space. If you look at these advanced capabilities in 5G or in automotive radar that are multi-antenna technologies, the amount of integration and the solutions that you need require a next level of innovation in RFICs beyond what we have today. We're looking more to unique algorithms that can do anything from solving impairments to providing a system level advantage to the overall performance. As we go to these advanced nodes, the availability of very high performance digital, the relative low cost of digital to that RF and analog performance means that innovation can happen by providing more and more solutions through algorithm space and through digital assistance than just traditional RF circuit design. The key is the future of RFIC technology is to continue to expand the horizons. Adding in advanced system level thinking, algorithms, digital assistance, and the addition of digital and system level solutions to solve the problems of RFICs in the future.